Hi, okay. I'm Christina. And I'm Randy. Are you ready for an adventure? Come see our journey today to the Hollywood sign. Was the sign behind us? Yeah, the sign's right there. Okay. If you haven't already done so, please take a moment to subscribe to our channel. It's the Hollywood sign. You don't have to hike trails and all that to get to the Hollywood sign. This is about as close as you can get. And it's Hollywood Lake Park. There's parking all along the street at Hollywood Lake Park. You can see the cars are all lined up. It costs nothing to park. It is a residential neighborhood, so you have to be very careful. So a good reference point, Canyon Lake Drive. 3000 North Canyon Lake Drive is a good reference point. The Hollywood sign was originally created in 1923 as a temporary advertisement for a real estate company. But due to all the increased recognition, the sign was left up and replaced in 1978 with a more durable and all steel structure. That's pretty interesting right there. Yeah. And then there's a, a piece of it. The piece before it was reconstructed to the Hollywood sign at the Hollywood Museum. This is your Canyon Lake Drive. This is the Hollywood uh, Lake Park. And there's plenty of parking all along here, all the way up, and you can hike up. It says local access only over here. But they've got a great view of a land, like a landing platform. So, but there's the Hollywood sign taking you up just a little bit further. And a great view of the Hollywood sign. And there's the street. There's plenty of parking at this point. Right now, 9.30 in the morning on a Saturday. It's really pretty up here. Sorry for the bad May gray. The Hollywood sign is more massive than I thought. <laughs> I think if I was next to it, I would look like an ant. Another nice thing I see about this little landing area is they've got trash cans over here for you, as well as over here. Department of Recreation and Parks. Brush area, no smoking. Of course, high fire danger. Really is a nice view. Actually, in as long as I've lived here, I've never been to the Hollywood sign. Sounds crazy, but I'm excited to be here. This is the Hollywood Reservoir, and you can see Hollywood down below. In the distance. I know that it'll sound strange to many people, but we see the Hollywood sign from a distance on a regular basis, but we don't go to visit it. We're doing something very touristy and it's a lot of fun for us today. The, they just let the tour, they let a tour bus off. People that purchase tours down on Hollywood Boulevard take these vans up to the Hollywood sign and they let you off so you can take a look at it as well as seeing other attractions around Hollywood. People come up, they don't pay any attention to the signs because they just want to see the Hollywood sign. And the residents that live here think they're all nuts. Well, it looks like everybody can drive up there. This is to show you that the people are parking along the street. And the tour buses back to pick up the people. 
that he dropped off. So pretty. People take pictures here. I'll show you a little Lake Hollywood Park here with the Hollywood sign in the background. This is pretty much the best place to come and see the sun. It says dogs must be on a leash. It looks like all the dogs are off the leash. <laughs> Uh, and it tells you where the dog park is located. That's pretty funny. So the park says, danger, rattlesnakes. Then you come down here, they got a little drinking fountain for dogs. Of course, little kids and adults. Then you go over to the kids' playground, <laughs> right on the gate. Caution, rattlesnakes. Well, just be aware. Caution rattlesnakes. <laughs> and that's where the kids' play yard is. <laughs> yeah. Well, at least they're telling you that they're there. <laughs> Maybe what they're trying to tell you is that the fence is where they keep them at. One point, no facilities. Make sure you go before you come. But it's beautiful. It's serene, it's silent. Nice trees, nice play yard. Well, if you're looking for a picture of the Hollywood sign, that's how you get it right there. In the park, Lake Hollywood Park. Let's see if we can get it. Oh, there it is. The Hollywood sign is among the most well-known landmarks in California and the United States. The sign makes frequent appearances in pop culture, especially in establishing shots for films and television programs set around the Hollywood area. It is visible from many points around the Los Angeles area. Tell we're in the hills. See that? That's a ground squirrel. Hi, little guy. Are you Chip or Dale? <laughs> what you doing? Yeah. What you doing? Right now, it's 10 o'clock. And as you can see from before, there's a lot more people now. The earlier you come to the Hollywood sign. The so there's no pedestrians beyond this point, but everybody was walking down this way anyway. Nobody seems to care. <laughs> There's somebody walking right now. Yep. And there's your Hollywood sign right there. Okay, this says local access only that Mulholland is closed. We're going further on Canyon Lake Drive. Um, they specifically state no pedestrians because this is a really tight two-lane road and there's no real place for the pedestrians to walk. So we're heading up further. Check out those houses up there. They've got a heck of a view. Oh, look at somebody's garage is here and they walk up the stairs. Well, and that's where their mail is too. Hmm. What do you know? We're going slow so that in case there's another car coming or that pedestrians are walking up or down, we'll be able to be out of the way. As you can see, there are pedestrians. <laughs> no, it said no pedestrians. Like that <laughs> okay. Mulholland will be closed until 531. Hmm. So you cannot go through. This is your roundabout, and this is where you're gonna turn around. Use Mulholland South Roadway. No vehicle access to the Hollywood sign.
See what that sign says? No pedestrians beyond this point. And here's people walking. <laughs> The tour bus looks like it's from Washington. And you can see there's a lot more people here, so it's important that you come early. The park opens at 8 a.m. Right now is about 10 10 in the morning on a Saturday, and you can see there's a lot more people for that beautiful Hollywood sign. See that. Yeah, the, 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 at this point there is no place to park, so it's important, like I said, to come early. And they're still picking up people along the way. We're showing you with this video that you can go to the Hollywood sign without making long hikes and spending entire days trying to see the, the sign. You can get closer by making those hikes in the mountains. If you enjoyed this vlog, please subscribe. And ring that notification bell. And give us a like. It lets us know you care. And we'll see you on the next one. Bye. Bye.